Are you a young professional looking to avoid the common debt pitfalls that can derail your financial future? Keep watching to learn how to steer clear of these costly mistakes. Before we get started, make sure to like, subscribe and comment on this video. We want to hear your thoughts and experiences. In this video, we will discuss the common traps that young professionals fall into when it comes to debt. We will also provide you with practical tips to manage and avoid debt effectively. By the end of this video, you will be better equipped to make informed financial decisions. Debt can be a serious issue for young professionals. With student loans, credit card debt and other financial commitments, it is easy to feel overwhelmed. This video aims to break down the complexities of debt and offer simple strategies to keep your finances in check. So what are the common debt pitfalls that young professionals should avoid? First, let's talk about student loans. Many young professionals graduate with significant student loan debt. The key is to understand your repayment options. Federal loans often offer income-driven repayment plans. These plans adjust your monthly payments based on your income level. This can make repaying your loans more manageable. Credit card debt is another major issue. Credit cards can be convenient, but they can also lead to high interest debt. It is important to pay off your balance in full each month. This helps you avoid interest charges and keeps your debt under control. If you carry a balance, focus on paying it down as quickly as possible. Consider using a balance transfer card with a lower interest rate. Another pitfall is lifestyle inflation. As you start earning more, it is tempting to upgrade your lifestyle. However, this can lead to increased expenses and debt. Try to live within your means, even as your income grows. Save and invest the extra money to build a strong financial foundation. Impulse spending is also a common issue. It is easy to make spontaneous purchases, especially with online shopping. To avoid this, create a budget and stick to it. Track your spending and identify areas where you can cut back. This will help you stay on top of your finances and avoid unnecessary debt. Many young professionals do not have an emergency fund. An emergency fund is crucial for covering unexpected expenses. Without one, you may have to rely on credit cards or loans. Aim to save three to six months worth of living expenses. This will give you a financial cushion and help you avoid debt in emergencies. Understanding the terms of your loans is also important. Some loans have variable interest rates, which can increase over time. Make sure you know what you are signing up for. If possible, opt for fixed rate loans to avoid surprises. It is also important to be cautious with co-signing loans. When you co-sign a loan, you are responsible for the debt if the primary borrower defaults. This can put your financial health at risk. Only co-sign if you are confident the borrower will make payments on time. Many young professionals overlook the importance of credit scores. Your credit score affects your ability to get loans and the interest rates you will pay. Make sure to pay your bills on time and keep your credit card balances low. Regularly check your credit report for errors and dispute any inaccuracies. Another issue is not seeking professional advice. Financial advisors can provide valuable guidance on managing debt. They can help you create a plan to pay off your debt and achieve your financial goals. Do not hesitate to seek professional help if you need it. Lastly, be aware of debt consolidation options. Debt consolidation can simplify your payments and reduce your interest rates. However, it is important to research and understand the terms. Make sure it is the right choice for your financial situation. By being aware of these common pitfalls and taking proactive steps, you can avoid debt and build a strong financial future. Stay disciplined, make informed decisions, and seek help when needed. Your financial health is in your hands.
Now let's talk about the steps you can take to avoid debt pitfalls as a young professional. First, create a budget. A budget helps you track your income and expenses. It shows you where your money is going and helps you identify areas where you can cut back. Second, build an emergency fund. Aim to save three to six months' worth of living expenses. This will give you a financial cushion for unexpected expenses. Third, pay off high-interest debt first. Focus on paying down credit card balances and other high-interest loans. This will save you money on interest and help you become debt-free faster. Fourth, avoid lifestyle inflation. Just because you are earning more does not mean you should spend more. Live within your means and save or invest the extra income. Fifth, be mindful of impulse spending. Create a shopping list and stick to it. This will help you avoid unnecessary purchases and keep your spending in check. Sixth, understand the terms of your loans. Know the interest rates, repayment schedules, and any fees. This will help you manage your debt more effectively. Seventh, regularly check your credit report. This will help you catch any errors or fraudulent activity. A good credit score is crucial for getting favourable loan terms. Eighth, seek professional advice if needed. Financial advisors can provide valuable guidance on managing and paying off debt. Do not hesitate to reach out for help. Before we move on to the rest of the video, if you are finding this helpful, please like, subscribe and comment, as it really helps this video reach a wider audience. Here is a case study related to young professionals. Avoid debt pitfalls. Meet Sarah, a young professional living in London. Sarah graduated with 30000 in student loan debt and had accumulated 5000 in credit card debt. She felt overwhelmed and did not know where to start. Sarah decided to take action by creating a strict budget and sticking to it. She cut back on non-essential spending and put any extra money towards her debt. Sarah also set up an emergency fund and focused on paying off her high-interest credit card debt first. She used a balance transfer card to reduce the interest rate on her credit card debt. This allowed her to pay it off faster. By following these steps, Sarah managed to pay off all her credit card debt within two years. She is now working on paying down her student loans and is on track to be debt-free in five years. To help deal with debt issues, start by creating a detailed budget. List all your income sources and expenses. Identify areas where you can cut back and use the extra money to pay off your debt. Prioritize paying off high-interest debt first as this will save you money in the long run. Another actionable step is to build an emergency fund. Aim to save three to six months' worth of living expenses. This will help you cover unexpected costs without relying on credit cards or loans. Finally, regularly check your credit report to ensure there are no errors or fraudulent activities affecting your credit score. If you found this video useful, please like and subscribe. We really appreciate it, and it helps us reach a wider audience. Thanks for watching.